Ugh. Ugh. Hello, lovely, lovely people. Um, so, <laughs> if you're wondering why you can't see the top of my head, it's because it looks like this. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> The reason my hair looks like this today, obviously you can tell by the title, is because I am going blonde. I am lightening my hair, bleaching my hair, whatever you want to say. My cosmetology school teacher would kill me if I said bleaching, so today we're going to say lightening my hair. Well, we might as well just get into it. I bought professional product from Cosmoprof. I got the Chi Lightener. It's a cream lightener. And I bought 20 volume developer and I did 20 volume just because um, I'm lightening my own hair and I don't want this to be one of those YouTube videos where all of my hair falls out or I damage it completely. And who knows, maybe I will damage it and I'll have to buzz it again, but we're going to have to see where this takes us. And I'm really mad I did not purchase gloves to do this with, so I'm just... Hopefully don't hurt my hands in the process. I am gonna be using a color applicator, but I'm gonna do 20 volume and I'm gonna do one round of bleaching. Keep it on for a good amount of time until I see a difference, probably like 15, 20 minutes. And then after that, if I feel like I want to go even lighter, I'll do um, another process. So I'm probably gonna be doing a double process today just because it is 20 volume and my hair is like a five and I wanna be around a seven or an eight so maybe I only have to do once we'll see what happens um no it's probably gonna have to be twice I also have Olaplex not to put in the bleach but to um condition my hair with afterward and I'll get more into that later and I also didn't bring I didn't buy a toner but I bought a purple toning shampoo by Joyco which is supposed to be one of the best for professional use and like I said before, I did go to cosmetology school. I am a cosmetologist. Like I'm obviously not gonna do everything perfect because I'm in my house, don't have gloves, and I'm just fucking around, you know? But I'm about to go on vacation and I really wanted to change. I really wanted to be blonde. <laughs> I can't get over this. If I don't already look like a mad scientist, I'm definitely gonna look like Albert Einstein after I do this. So I'm gonna get my coloring bowl and applicator brush and I am going to squeeze some of the Chi cream lightener in here and this smells like cherry candy and I usually would be opposed to that but honestly I'm not right now and I have a lot of hair so I'm gonna put a good amount in there. I hope I don't run out of this. I don't think I will. Um, and then I'm gonna take my 20 volume developer and I'm not really measuring this. I'm just kind of going for a consistency that looks good to me. Oh, sorry, I squeezed a little more of the lightener in there. No, I don't think I'll run out. And a little more of the developer. Mix it and mix it and mix it and mix it. Okay, so this is kind of the consistency I'm at. I'm not looking for anything too specific. I just know when it looks like it is good. Oh my god, wait, now I'm actually... <laughs> god, now I'm gonna be annoying again about how nervous I am. I'm kinda nervous now. Fuck, this better not be one of those YouTube videos where it's like, oh my god, I ruined all my hair. But if I did, I would just buzz it again and that's not a big issue to me, obviously. Are we ready? We're gonna start, I'm looking over here because there's a mirror in front of me, so I'm sorry. Should we do frosted tips? Wait. <laughs> so right now, I'm not really trying too hard. I mostly just want to coat the ends. And I'm not applying too much pressure. And then, after the end sit for a little bit. Does that look like it's already working? No, wait, no. That's just the lighting. <laughs> okay, sorry. And I just wanna say I'm one of those people, I don't really go, um, right here, I'm gonna, 
I don't really go to get my hair done anywhere. My mom's done my hair my whole life, so I've literally never had to pay to get my hair done. And the thought of doing that now, where I'm a broke 22 year old living in a city, I really don't have the money to spend on my, I don't have the money to spend on my hair. But I know what I'm doing. I did, I'm like taking a lot of precautions and correct steps and I know what I've done wrong, hence me talking about the gloves so much. I'd rather do so much stuff myself, like waxing, um, cutting my hair, like I tried trimming some of it last night just so like make it less thick, like, you know, a little. The back is probably gonna be the only issue today, but even so, I don't think it's gonna be that bad. Oh, I forgot to put like something around the perimeter of my like hairline. I can do, oh my God, Guy Fieri tees. We love that, we love that. Oh my God, wait, I'm gonna look like Guy Fieri. <gasps> I was excited because I thought I was gonna look like Draco Malfoy. Wait, that's so much better that I'm gonna look like Guy Fieri. <laughs> Maybe like the Freeze Meister? Jack Frost in Santa Claus, maybe number three or four. I can't remember which one it was. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go rinse this off. Give me one second. <laughs> or you can watch me rinse it off. I'm just gonna sit here, literally. I'll just sit here, um, have my phone, let this sit for a few minutes, and then I'm gonna start combing it through, I think, which isn't the best thing to do with whitener, but because I really don't know what else to do and I don't have gloves, I'm just gonna do that. <laughs> I thought I was recording, but I started to comb it through. Founding father tease, oh my god. I'm gonna make a little more. I'm just gonna not look at it for a few minutes. One eternity later. Now that I look pretty Draco Malfoy-ish, I'm gonna go rinse it out, I think. There's still like a few spots around the perimeter that could lighten up, but maybe I'll just go over those. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I just got a message, but I'm gonna rinse this out. Guys, I forgot to mention, this is the shampoo I'm using. It's the Joyco Color Balance Purple Shampoo. Okay, you guys. <laughs> this is what it looks like after round number one. Obviously, very golden, very warm, very... If you know who I look like, tell me down below. I'm about to put it on the screen. Um, I know exactly who I look like right now. I'll do round two right now, I guess, because, I mean, might as well. Might as well. I'm gonna take you into the bathroom this time so we can do this in there. I'm gonna take the lightener and just do it to it, my dude. I'm gonna take a shower. <laughs> so, <laughs> it is definitely 
more on the yellow side i probably should have bought actual toner but who cares i'm like sorry it's just the sunlight i had to take advantage i had to take advantage of the moment i'm really happy but overall i really like it. it is definitely a little bit yellow but i'm kind of into it you know i kind of feel like maybe that's the look i was going for you know <laughs> so i bet you thought that was the end of the video because so did i but yeah um it's not this is not the color i want to end on it's now friday i filmed me bleaching my hair on wednesday after sitting with this for a while and going to work i realized this is way too yellow for me. It doesn't look too bad right now, but I promise you, it just is so weird. It doesn't go well with my skin tone, I feel like. I just feel like it's too yellow. And I am going to go to Cosmoprof. I'm going to get a toner. I really thought I could get away with not using a toner and just using purple shampoo because I didn't have the energy to research good toners but i'm kind of trying to remember stuff from beauty school and i think i'm gonna do goldwell colorants in like an 8 ca i think this is like an 8 um i might lighten a little bit again just a tiny bit because obviously like i feel like i didn't get my roots and now they're already growing in too which is just that shit it's been a fucking day and this is my, my mom deals with this shit literally 24 7 so i should have known that my hair would fucking do this. Okay, so we're gonna bleach this bad boy again. We are back in my kitchen. I once again was at Cosmoprof and did not buy gloves, so that's great. Deja vu, we are gonna take the lightning cream. And I really don't want to keep this on too long because obviously I lightened my hair already. It's just so yellow. <laughs> okay, I think I've left this on long enough. I don't want to damage my hair anymore. So we're gonna go rinse this out and then we will tone. So when I was in Cosmoprof, um, I asked one of the girls that was working there what toner she thinks I should use and what level she thought I was. Um, so we ended up, she said she really likes the Luma Shine by Joyco. Oh my God, I can't, I can't take myself seriously. But yeah, so I got the Luma Shine Joyco color and um you can literally use any color as a toner so basically she told me that her friend used this on her with a um developer with five volume uh so basically i'm gonna be mixing these together it's a one-to-one -one ratio putting it on top of wet hair because that's how i've been taught to tone in school and we're just gonna see what goes on and yeah but basically to get the one to one ratio i have a little measure back here that i'm going to use is that focused bitch is you blind i look insane yay 1.1 so we just have to bring it up to 2.2 if this bad boy did it come again? No, it did not. So I'll just have to squeeze it out. You're gonna break the top off. So this is 1.1 ounces, so now I'm gonna add 1.1 of Joico, hopefully. Because this thing like picks up on the weight really late. I didn't say what the color of this was. I got 9N. Yeah, 9N, which is basically just neutral. I liked the swatch that I saw of it. And yeah, I'm not trying to be like white. I just don't want to be yellow. I really hope this works. Let's do it, ladies.
it definitely looks like it'll be a nice muted blonde which is what i want i feel like that'll look good with a tan okay so toner works really fast so i'm just gonna rinse this out now hopefully it's what i want it to be okay but this is how it turned out after toning it i think it looks good i look like peter pan in some light it looks strawberry blonde and in other lights it looks really blonde but i definitely think it matches my skin tone better than the bright yellow did it's definitely a color that i can fuck with but i'm not mad at it i like it i like it um yeah i feel like this video was kind of boring like my last hair video was insane and stressful this one i was kind of stressed but i was hoping it'd work out and i had faith in myself so if you were expecting something crazy i'm sorry if you guys liked this video please give it a thumbs up comment down below tell me what you think don't be too harsh please don't roast me too much this is it i love you guys so much i will see you soon bye <laughs>